We got another box for you. You want to open the box? See. Speak. Good boy. Here, open it. Hey. There he goes. He's trying so hard. <laughs> Alright, that's good enough. Look at that. What is that? Oh. It doesn't have a battery. Let's put a battery on it. This thing low-key looks like a gun. And since I live in the ghetto, you never know. I really want to test out this light. This is badass. <laughs> it does seem pretty thin. We're gonna have to test it out. This is pretty cool. This will be the creepiest episode I have ever featured on my channel. Still not complete darkness, so I might wait a bit more. The house is pretty much all darkness. I just recently figured out the ISO settings. The ISO settings on the GoPro, so things look much brighter. Hopefully it doesn't rip while we're running. Let's go ahead and give it the benefit of the doubt. Milo, get over here. Damn fruit. Ready? Go. Oh my gosh. I got an idea. So we strapped the no hands leash, but we will be using this as the primary pull. If he does pull it hard and it rips, I'll still have control of him. Okay, so. He is pulling me. He runs so fast at night, it's really scary. He will be pulling me with the flashlight leash. <laughs> I wonder if you guys could even see him. I'm pretty sure you guys just see a running dog. Hopefully you guys even see that. Night rides are always awesome. What lies beneath the dusk? <gasps> Can you guys see him? <laughs> <laughs> takes three of the little batteries. It does light the way ahead of you, which would be the primary use for this leash. I'm pretty sure 70% of you guys will not be using the leash the same way I use it. The real test would be if he sees a cat, he'll probably rip the shit out of this leash. He has done that to my previous leash that was the same as this. Now the thing that would rip is the thing all the way to the end. That's what's most vulnerable. This is the first night video that I've ever filmed. This is complete darkness. This is as dark as it gets here. Like I was saying, this is complete darkness. The no hands leash is not being used. The only sad part about this video is that you guys won't see my hand motions. I know you guys love my hand motions. Let me know if you guys enjoy these night rides. The light is actually retractable. I'm holding the light right now. I left the bags on. Go. Go! Go, boy! In order for the leash to rip, he would have to make like a sudden tug. Oh shit, he sees a squirrel. I felt the VTEC on the longboard and I loved it. That was awesome. Let's go. Where do you want to go, Crypto? <laughs> He's like, I want to piss on this. I think I'm getting freaking sick. Sick of all these haters. I'm just kidding. Gotta love my haters. All right, let's turn the light back on. There we go. Now I'm enlightened. <gasps> oh, there's a person. Oh, where's this guy going? This dog loves night rides. This is probably his most favorite thing to do. Run at night. I do love night rides myself. They could always be sketchy at night. Oh, shit. And that's why I hate night rides. I do not want to face plant today. That was scary. As long as there's street lights, we should be Gucci. 
I just keep the light on him just to keep him shining bright like a diamond. Oh, it's cold and there's a little breeze. Can't get better than this. Oh, he's hitting the B-Tech like there's no tomorrow. Go, Crypto! Go, oh, boy! Oh my gosh, he sees the cat! No! Crypto! This way. Oh, it smells like chicken. That can't help at all. I love seeing my dog happy. Gee! This is me lighting the pavement. I don't know how well the GoPro picks it up. I do know there's a huge crack somewhere nearby. This is what I was talking about when I was saying that you need to know the path ahead of you. If you don't know what's ahead, you shouldn't be going top speed. I actually do live in the hood. My town's known for extreme violence. I try to not pay attention to all of that stuff, but this thing kind of does look like a gun. It's a sniper riffle. First I was cold and now I'm hot. That's probably why I'm getting sick. God boy. I'm really enjoying this longboard. It makes his running much easier. The what's the best skateboard to exercise my dog with video is coming up. Since I was missing the proper equipment on my skateboard, like the washers, that's the reason why the bearings burnt through the tires. The wheels didn't have the spacers, so the nut was actually burning through the bearings. Let's give this dog a quick little break. Oh, he follows me, God boy. There you go, hit the limit. This thing is retractable. Both of these are retractable. Now these right here are disposable bags. If your dog decides to take a dump, boom, you're strapped. The reason why I left them on was because if you leave just the flashlight on, it distributes the weight unevenly. So if they're both on, the weight is distributed. Oh gosh, will it snap? actually did loosen the trucks. Little kitty, cat run. Oh, he saw it. What a, oh, he almost ate shit. Oh, the cat's just staring at us. Oh, they're setting something up. I hope it's like a stripper house. Hey, no dogs on the sand. Why should there be cats? At this very moment, I'm gonna switch the ISO to the highest ISO there is. The highest ISO there is is 6,400. If you guys don't know about photography, all ISO does, it widens the hole that the camera sees through to allow more light to go in, just like my ex. That was not appropriate at all. If I get robbed, at least it'll be on film. This ain't a freaking stroll through the park, doc. One thing I always hated was when people got scared for no reason. Another thing I really hate, when people alert you that there's a cop nearby. That is really annoying. That's probably one of my biggest pet peeves. They're like, oh, there's a cop. Okay, what do you want me to do? What does he see? He wants to go for something. I wanted to come down here just because it would be really scary. And now that I came, yep, it's scary. You never know if there's a freaking hobo living inside those bushes. A little bit more down there, there was actually like a bed and everything set up for a homeless dude. That was really sketch. I hope you guys enjoyed this, this night vlog. It was a little bit different. Testing out this flashlight leash, the rat, Milo. This leash is more suited for those type of dogs. But of course we had to test it out with crypto first. If the leash can handle crypto, the leash can handle any dog. Go home. Good boy. Oh snap, we have a bike person. That was probably the fastest he's ever eaten a chicken leg. Chew your food. Carrots. I actually gave him a carrot yesterday and he ate it just fine. Eat the carrot. He's watching the fruit. 
Well, that's gonna go ahead and be it for this one, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Peace. Feel free to follow my Snapchat and my Instagram at KZE underscore production.